What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Kemp Fitness Professional. And we have done it, guys. This is the end of day seven in the books. Hard to drive fast. One week, no food, no water, complete. I just went for my hour-long walk. And I got to watch the sun set, a fiery red sun setting. I'll show you guys where it sets. Right over there. Right over the ocean, over the mountain. I'm chilling up here in my little ridge in the backyard. And guys, this has been a trip. I'm not even going to lie. I don't have that much to say in this video because I'm like speechless. It's crazy. I just went seven days without food and water and I feel totally fine. Like I'm good. I honestly was going to go until tomorrow morning and then break it on the start of a new day and then that way I would have the whole day to like rehydrate in sequence as opposed to starting to hydrate tonight, stopping and then picking it back up again in the morning. Like partially because I don't want to pee the bed because apparently like when you have your first couple glasses of water it goes through you in like 20 minutes. But um, I just went for an hour long walk and uh, it was just sitting with it and thinking about it and feeling it out. And it's right to break it tonight. It's the 24 hour mark of seven days. And I honestly like all day today, I was like, I'm going to wait till tomorrow because I feel fine. I could keep going. Like that's what's mind blowing about this guys. Like everything we've been told to believe about what the capacity is, the limited capacity of the human organism is so much deeper than we even know. It's crazy. And I mean, I'm not the first. If you di 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 dive into this dry fasting thing, there's plenty of people that have gone 10, 15. Some people, I saw one guy, he's went like 21 days, which that's fucking crazy. But I fucking believe it. Like, absolutely. If your body, your mind, and your spirit are synchronized and they are in the right state of being, man, what isn't possible, you know? Like, we're just limited by our beliefs our conditioned beliefs <sighs> i'm not even that tired like it's weird yesterday five, day five and day six i was a little more fatigued last night i got seven hours of sleep and i felt steady all day i didn't even get the afternoon lull which i've gotten like every day i didn't even really get that today and it was the same fucking thing i've done every day wake up i woke up at 4 30 did some research on dry fasting for a couple hours, followed it up with Kriya Yoga and meditation, then some joint mobilization, and then a little metabolic stimulus, five minutes. I did 25 body squats, 25 hip hinges, 25 push-ups, 25 band pulls. I did that two times through. Just a little, you know, just to get the blood flowing and feeling good. And then I had two Facebook Lives, and then I just did business work, um, did, wrote some journaling on this fast, and uh, answered a bunch of calls, got more people signed up for the bodyweight challenge. Woo! That's starting, deadline today, starting on Sunday, so I'm stoked about that. And uh, yeah, then I had another appointment and then went on my walk, and it was all perfect timing. I went on my walk right as the sun was setting, so I got to watch it. If you watch my Instagram, I wanted to get up here and watch the sunset, do a little sun gazing or sun eating, if you will. Eat the sun with the third eye, soak up some more energy. But uh, I stopped to smell the flowers too much. Literally, if you follow my Instagram, well, you guys are going to be seeing this late. But I stopped and I uh, smelled some flowers and uh, caught some really good views. But uh, I still saw the sunset. I stopped and watched it for a minute. And then I uh, came up here. And uh, yeah, I'm not even going to make this one long, guys. I don't, I don't even want to give you informational content. Like, it's not even about that at this point. I just want you to get this feeling. Gratitude. Amazement. True happiness. What a life, guys. What what a life. This has just opened my mind to a whole new potential of the human organism. So... I guess I'll leave it at that for you guys. I'm going to uh, go right now. I'm going to go way. It's like an hour out from 24. 
And so I'm going to go away. I'm, I got to drive to the gym. I don't have a scale at home. And that's the scale I've been using. So I'm going to drive to the gym. I'm going to step on the scale. I'm going to see what my final weigh-in was. At the end of day five, I was 21 pounds down. And so it's been two more days. I'm guessing I've lost another two pounds. I'm going to guess 23 pounds. So I went from 197 to we'll see what my final weight is. I'm going to guess 194. Fucking crazy. But I am going to go do the weigh-in and then I'm going to come home and I'm going to sit in meditation for a few minutes, probably nothing crazy. And honestly, just like sit in silence and gratitude and prepare to nourish my body with the life force of water, one of the life forces, including the sun and the air and the earth. Ah, and then the sweet ether, baby, that prana, that chi flowing in from the 5D, that kundalini shakti. Just fucking feeling great. I don't know how I feel this good. I'm not like... I may sound tired or fatigued, but it's just a, it's a place of peace and contentment. I feel no need to be energetic. I don't feel a need to do anything. I feel just so grateful. Just want to sit with a smile on my face. But anyway, I'm going to go away and then come home, sit in meditation for a minute. And then I'm going to do another video for you guys, which I'll post, which will be titled How to Break a Dry Fast Part 1. And I'm going to go through in each of the parts and talk about, similar like this vlog series, how to appropriately go into the process of breaking a dry fast because you don't want to start with solid food. You absolutely do not want to start with solid food. You are going to be hurting and maybe puking. So I'm going to break that sequence down exactly what ingredients I've used and am using or am using. I haven't used anything yet, <laughs> but what I purchased at the store yesterday. I think I told you guys about that already. But I'm going to break it down as far as like the schedule that I have written out because you want to go uh, start with water, salt water, essentially replace the electrolytes and uh, then go from there. So that's going to be the next video. Check that out. How to break a dry fast part one. And then I'll continue to do different episodes as I go through the breaking of the dry fast process of what I continue to incorporate. So I know this video is getting dark. It's getting dark outside. I love you guys so much. Thanks for tuning in. Tag somebody, share this with somebody, show them what's possible, blow some fucking minds open, folks. We need to raise the vibration by spreading positivity and awareness. That is my mission here, and that is why I'm doing this vlog, because I am transmitting the message to you that we have unlimited potential as long as we tap into it and stand together. Together we rise, baby. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Much love.